Hey, what's up, y'all? This is Trey here. This is the Workout Challenge with the Billionaire Success Team. We have less than a week to go before Miami, so we got to get right. We got to get tight. No excuses here. And what I'm going to do for you right now is I'm going to leave it where you have no excuses to be able to take this week and just explode the rest of this week with your workout. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a quick workout here in the space of my bathroom. I don't even have my work. I don't even have my pull-up bar. I don't have any equipment. I don't have any of that. The only thing I have here is some walls, a sink, and my, and my mind, right? And I'm going to just use those three things to do a quick workout. And maybe you can follow along with this, all right? But you have to have really, really, really tough mind control if you're going to be able to do the five the exercises that I'm going to do real quick, right? So I'm going to start out with something simple. I'm going to start out with a bicep curl, except, again, I don't have any equipment, right? So it's like, how are you going to do a bicep curl with, with any equipment? What I'm going to do is I'm going to use my mind. So in my hand, I have a 45-pound dumbbell in my hand right now. And you can do the same thing. What you're going to do is just, you're just going to use your brain. You're going to have a 20-pound. You're going to have a 10-pound. You're going to have a 50-pound and a 60-pound if you want. right? And it's just going to be all in your mind of how much you're lifting right now. right? If I want to lift a 10-pound, I can make it easy. If I want to lift a 100-pound, I can make it super hard for me to get it up and struggle. You know, I'm just going to have a simple 45-pound weight. where, And you also want to fill your muscle because you only want to work this part of your arm. Here, all right, so you want to make sure that you're just contracting and just moving nothing else but the bicep part of your arm, and in your head, you're thinking about how much weight you're pulling up. All right, so you just want to do 10 of those contracted bicep curls, and you just want to let it free when you're going down. No resistance when you're going down, it's just coming up, and then just using that part of your arm. You can do a little twist at the top, all right, you can just come straight up. You just want to do that, all right? You just turn around, you do the same thing for the other side, all right? You just want to think about that weight in your head, about the same weight that you did on the other arm. You want to have just as much resistance on this arm because you don't want to have a bigger right arm or left arm, all right? All right? So just do a few of those. Make sure you're concentrating mind control just on that part of the arm. You don't want to know exactly the muscle that you're working on. All right, so that's you can do the same thing. That's just that's for your biceps, right? You can do the same thing for your shoulders if you just want to do, you know, military press. You know, just go up like that and just have these two head, these two weights that you got. It's all in your brain, right? How much you pushing up there, you know? And you can do that. Or what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna just do some um, some um, some um, what are they called? I don't even know what they're called. They're called uh, wall push-ups, if you want to call it that, or handstand push-ups, whatever you want to call it, I'm going to just do a few of those because I know that works a lot in my upper body as far as the shoulders and the back are concerned. So I'm going to just do a few of those. Just a few of them. All right, the next I'm just going to use this sink here. I'm going to do some simple dips. It's not going to use too much weight, right? Just want to have your hands close to your body as you can. You just want to go down and use your arms to pull up all your weight when you dip yourself down. Have your legs going straight all the way out as far as it can go. All right, and that's just working your triceps right there. If you want to add in some push-ups. Of course, push-ups, everybody knows how to do push-ups. You add in a few of those. You can have it be wide pull-ups or close pull-ups. Yeah. All right, so that was real simple, right? You take a break, you do those all over again, maybe about three or five times, and you have a simple workout for the day, just that quick. You know, tomorrow we'll do something else. All right, peace out.